Hello friends, I'm Paris and this is our second video in Python Flask web development for absolute beginners. Uh, in the previous video we have learned uh, about uh, creating a simple web page in Flask and also we had a simple introduction to Flask uh, framework. Now in this video we are going to talk about creating dynamic routes in Flask. So now let's get started and I'm going to open my PyCharm ID. So this is uh, my PyCharm ID and I have created a new Python file. Let me first import, so from Flask, import Flask, and let me create Flask object. And now let me, uh, for right now, let me just create my route. So app.route, this is the index route, diff index. And let me return a uh, hello index page. If underscore underscore name. And now you need to run your app app dot round run and make the debugging to true. Okay. Now if I run this. Okay, now I'm waiting for this dip restarting and uh, okay, now if I click on this, now I'm waiting. Okay, now uh, you can see that this is hello index page. Now, uh, if uh, a user click, for example, if he want uh, to uh, bring the contact page and if you click on contact you can see that uh, the requested URL was not found so now how you can handle this uh, for this uh, let me create another route in here so at app dot route and for example this is the uh, contact route we name it and if uh, contact return uh, this uh, or we can tell it welcome to contact page okay now let me save this and let me uh, refresh this now if I hit enter now you can see this uh, now we have received welcome to contact page now this is our index hello index and uh, if uh, I go to the contact, now this is our contact page. Uh, you can add more routes uh, if you want. For example, let me add another route in here. Dot route, and this is, for example, register and diff register my view function. And now I can return. Uh, this is, or we can call it, welcome to register iteration page <coughs> okay now if I save it and if I refresh my page and uh, now if I go to the so let me just check this uh, debugger is active I have a problem so let me just check this okay sorry i have uh, forgot to add okay now if i refresh this so now this is contact if i uh, write register and now you can see welcome to registration page and contact this is contact and this is index Okay, now uh, how you can add uh, parameters to your URLs. Now I'm going to show you uh, for this. So for example, in here I want to add a name uh, a parameter. You can add name in here. Now I want to print that name. So welcome to page. For example, Mr. Uh, uh, you can uh, write the placeholder uh, like this and name. 
so now let me uh, save and let me refresh this and uh, for now if I go to the contact it will give me error because I have uh, a, a parameter in here so I want to give a uh, pathways so let me just check this that where is the problem and uh, So let me just contact. Okay, now I think, oh yeah, the problem is in here. I have forgot to add like this. Uh, like this you can add parameter. Now I'm going to save this and I'm going to hit enter. Uh, now it should be restarted and yeah now you can see welcome to page Mr. Parwiz and if I change this to John and welcome Mr. John and you can do do uh, welcome to uh, also uh, you can add HTML so for example I want to make it bold so each one you can add in here and uh, each one now let me just refresh my page now you can see that uh, now it's bold so thank you guys uh, if you have any question please let me know and for the further videos please subscribe to my channel